While South Africa's sluggish economy is a cause for concern for most, analysts believe that political uncertainty will further plunge the country in more trouble. It certainly is not positive for investment because I think investors worry. What it really means, does it mean that investments are, investments are going to be expropriated? Does it mean the black economic empowerment requirements are going to move up, say, from 26% to 51%, which is what Eskim has done to the coal mining industry here? That's, so there's all that uncertainty around that. I don't think that's very positive. On Tuesday, State Security Minister David McClure told the Parliament that Plans are well underway to ensure that private security industry regulation amendment bill is passed. But mining expert Peter Leon says this could cost the country more as it might face sanctions from trading partners. South Africa has already, you know, there's already been the issue with chicken, U.S. chicken exports to South Africa during the Obama administration um, where there was an out-of-cycle out review by the Obama administration on South Africa's trade policies. In the end, South Africa was not removed from the GOA, but clearly that provision in the law in the U.S. is such that the U.S. could now implement another out of cycle review and we could lose our GOA status. So that, that certainly is a risk. One analyst says South Africa needs to do more to retain investor confidence and to ensure that its GDP picks some strength. We are the major trading power on the continent. We export far more than we import. We could be exporting more, but we're very cautious when it comes to negotiating trade deals on the continent, and certainly cautious when it comes to our key comparative advantage, which is services. Whilst the Federation of Unions of South Africa, FEDUSA, hopes that a solution to bring South Africa back to its foot will be found soon, rating agency Fiji is concerned about ongoing economic and political situation in the country, with Moody's expected to decide on the rating sovereignty in June. Pomato, ANN7, Johannesburg.